start is sort out the dance rehearsals. Don't start, Amira. Why are you and Christian going to just kiss and make up? Mm, I was beginning to wonder if we were working on our own today. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, Amira's Mendy outfit was being delivered by couriers. They've done such a beautiful job. Well, if you don't mind, I've got a rather large order to finish. Are you all right, Jane? No, I wouldn't it be. <laughs> I don't know. You just seem a bit on. Lucy, can you make a start on the desserts, please? This is slave labour. Mm. I'm assuming I can leave you to deal with the savoury buffet? Of course. Then I'll start packing the crackers. Hi, um, listen, I'm, I'm looking for a job. You know, full-time, part-time, anything, really. Sorry, bothering you. Uh, no, Bradley, um, when can you start? Sorry? We've got a few functions coming up over Christmas and New Year. Oh, dear, that'd be great. Well, uh, pop back tomorrow and we'll get you started on your induction. Oh, I don't know what to say. Thanks, Jane. <laughs> Merry Christmas, brothers. Look, I'm sorry I'm late. Where have you been? Taking your advice. I need to talk to you. I think we've said all there is to say, don't you? Christian, what do I have to do to tempt you back to dance rehearsal? I've already told you. I'm not interested. But we need your help. I hate to break it to you, but not all gay men are extra and born choreographers, all right? I don't get you two. One minute you're the best of friends, next minute you can't stand the sight of each other. All right, that's everything packed and ready to go. Well, I'm not done yet. Just get changed, Lucy. Um, Saeed, would you and Amira take the first batch over, please? Well, I could help Saeed if you like. No, I need you here. Well, if it's the same to you, I'd rather not. Just do what I say, yeah? Somebody's in trouble. What the hell have you done, Christian? Six months! Look, I'm sorry, Jane, but I didn't think to send out engraved announcements. <gasps> well, who else knows about this? Just Lucy. You told her before you told your own sister? Funnily enough, Lucy finding out was never part of the plan. And I'll take it Amira doesn't know. Do you think I'd still be here if she did? <sighs> this is too much to get my head around. Saeed isn't gay. Then he's a damn good actor. He's getting married next week. Well, excuse me if I don't join in with the celebrations. You know, you never change, do you, Christian? You always want what you can't have. Even when we were kids, you want to play with my toys. You don't know what you're talking about. Well, they all crack in the end, don't they? I mean, who's next on the list? Jack Brannan? Ian? I love him. Like you loved my first husband. You don't know the meaning of the word. Have you thought about the repercussions for our family, for this business? No. Because I was too busy getting my heart broken. You got any idea what it's been like for me? Watching them plan their whole lives together. You know what, sis? I thought you'd be the one person come out fighting my corner. Oh, and just for the record, he came on to me. Is it still going on? We ended it a couple of weeks ago. Then there's nothing to worry about, is there? Saeed goes off and gets married, leaving you to find someone who's... unattached. Like it's that simple. What other solution is there, Christian? Tickets to Barcelona? It's like you said. Why should we let his family stand in our way? I didn't know you were talking about Saeed. And that makes a difference, does it? It makes all the difference. <sighs> Do you know what, Jane? You're a hypocrite. I can't let you do this. We could just get away from Walford, the mosque. We might stand a chance. This is madness. I love him. Then you're on your own. <laughs> 